And once again, it was a cold start to the day with some fog and some scattered frost. And then the afternoons, hazy and mild, all because of this ridge of high pressure that just refuses to leave California and much of the western United States. You see all this cloud cover from some storms out in the Pacific going well off to the north into Canada. And then the, there's that flow of the wind moving right into southern California through the passes and canyons. Once again, the sand and winds are picking up tonight. There's a disturbance off of the coast of Baja, California, sending in some cloud cover to parts of southern California and the Central Valley. But... No rain associated with those clouds that are just basically a decoration in the sky. So winds are going to pick up again tonight. Not as severe as what they were early on in the week, but they're still going to be fairly strong. A big concern for firefighters once again. Uh, future cast shows winds picking up tomorrow morning. This is Santa Clarita, about 22 mile hour winds here, but you see the shades of orange and red right here. That's where winds start to pick up to about 30 to 40 miles an hour, and it looks like that's going to continue. It'll calm down in the daytime on Monday, then pick up again Monday night into Tuesday morning. And San Diego County, winds are picking up there as well, but that high wind warning for San Diego County, that's expired, but the red flag warning for much of Southern California from San Diego in the south to Santa Barbara in the north has been extended until tomorrow. It was set to expire tonight. And if you looked off to the west today, you probably noticed some of that smoke. If you were on the west side of the valley, it's fairly hazy. This is the central coast. A picture sent into one of our ABC 30 insiders, Bill Pentagrass of Shell Beach. Notice all that smoke right there, right along the coastline. It goes right out of the Pacific, then it spills out along the coastline. It has nowhere to go because of this ridge of high pressure. This is a little further north of Shell Beach in Cambria. That thick layer of smoke, and you see some clearing right there off in the distance, but as long as that ridge is in place, the smoke basically has nowhere to go, and it's impacting our visibility here in the valley, in addition to some patchy fog in the morning and late night hours. That haze is just sticking around, and visibility for most of the valley about uh, four to seven miles, so not bad, but it's not the best air quality or best visibility we've had from here in some time. We really needed a good soaking of rain to clean up the atmosphere. 54 tonight in Fresno, but we're in the 40s for Madeira, Merced, Hanford, and Porterville this evening, give or take a degree too, about the same compared to this time yesterday. Same deal for high temperatures this afternoon. We had 64 in Merced, Fresno, 63 in Visalia, the high of 64, above the average of 56 for this time of year, and well below records. Those are in the low 70s for early December. Modern air quality North Valley tomorrow. Unhealthy for sensitive groups, Fresno County southward. Wood burning is prohibited. Valleywide, once again, you're not allowed to use your fireplace unless it is a clean burning register device. In the Sierra, plenty of sunshine up there. Really nice for December. Upper 50s to lower 60s. Photo communities, 60s and 70s tomorrow. Mild afternoons, hazy sunshine. Tonight in the valley, it's going to be hazy out there and still cold. Overnight lows will be in the 30s throughout most of the valley. And then tomorrow, same deal once again. Patchy fog or frost temperatures in the 60s, mild for December here. And the seven-day forecast shows little change here. The only significant difference, maybe later on in the week, we'll see some cloud cover Friday into Saturday, but no rain associated with those clouds. Uh, this is a very stubborn, very quiet weather pattern for us here, but overall, there's not much going on. It'd be nice to see some rain here, but at least we have some comfortable temperatures in the afternoon. All right, looks good. I mean, looks enjoyable. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you, Ruben. Chris,